How is platinum extracted from its ore? An ore is a naturally occurring mineral from which a pure metal can be extracted. For platinum, the two chief minerals are spirulite or platinum arsenide PTS2 and cooperate or platinum sulfide PTS. Extracting platinum from these ores is arguably one of the most capital and labor intensive operations in the world. On average, it takes up to 6 months and up to 12 tons of ore to produce an industry standard troy ounce, which is 31.135 grams of pure metal. However, in mining using 4.5 tons of ore to produce 1 gram of platinum would not be considered abnormal. The extraction process before a mine is even opened the potential site is explored and assessed for viability. In other words, is it profitable to extract the metal from the ore? Assuming that this process demonstrates the commercial viability the mining operation is established, the actual process can begin. Foam flotation, the platinum ore is crushed and milled, which increases the surface area of the metal and making it easier to extract all the valuable metals. Froth flotation is a method of separating materials on the basis of their physical properties, for instance affinity for water or density. In platinum mining the crushed solid mixture is immersed in water which also contains dissolved reagents to separate out individual compounds, which are then removed in the form of slurry. Platinum is third densest metal in the crust so it will sink to the bottom of the tank. And the impurities can also be removed. In addition, because nickel and iron have different magnetic properties to platinum they can be removed by running a powerful electromagnet above the mixture. Another method of separation is to bubble air through the mixture, so that the platinum ore grains not the platinum itself react with oxygen forming a slurry on the surface which can be skimmed off. Drying and purification The wet platinum slurry is heated in specialist furnaces which maintain a temperature of 1500 degrees. At the same time, Air is blown through the mixture so that any impurities such as iron or sulfur are removed. The result is a fine powder that is less than 1% platinum. Metals such as nickel, copper or cobalt are removed by agitating the powder in concentrated solutions of hydrochloric and sulfuric acids. These mixtures of acids are known as aqua regia and in effect dissolve the platinum compounds but leave the other metal compounds suspended. Electrolysis The platinum and aqua regia solution is then subject to an electrical current. The solution itself acts as an electrolyte, a liquid or molten solid which allows the passing of electricity. The platinum metal is attracted to the negative terminal the cathode where it is collected. Finally, platinum also has a very high melting point 1768 degrees and other impurities can be burned off leaving pure platinum metal. The overall process involves several interrelated and complex processes which employ both physical and chemical techniques. However, the fact that other valuable metals can be extracted in tandem with platinum makes the whole process much more cost effective. In some cases, it is even obtained as a byproduct of nickel and copper mining.